Hello everybody, today on That's a Farm, we're gonna be reviewing the Seidel Sheep Chair. Warning, this sheep chair is not from Seidel. It's the premier deck chair for sheep from Amazon for $150. My grandpa bought it one day because he was bored. We're gonna see if it actually works. This review will be split up into three different parts. Quality, functionality, and practicality. I just love words with ality at the end. It's very exceptionality. Anyway, let's talk about quality. The chair itself is very well built, weighing 25 pounds of alloy steel and elastic webbing. It's strong enough to hold the largest sheep we have and is exceptional with human use. It's pretty comfortable if I do say so myself. It's kind of like a hammock. Before I go any further, what is the actual reason why we're testing out this sheep chair? We didn't just wrangle up all the sheep to test it out and make sure it works. We're doing it because, out of nowhere, my dad called us all out to check all of our sheep's hooves. And when I mean all, I mean over a hundred Katahdin sheep. We've been seeing a few of them limping around, so we decided to check all of them to make sure we didn't miss any. My dad says he didn't know that we were gonna be doing all of them because he had a plan, but it didn't work, so we're gonna be doing this alternative, the very hard alternative that nobody wants to do. We're just gonna have to see if this chair makes it easier for us. Following quality, we have functionality. This sheep chair is basically used to doctor sheep, like trimming their hooves and giving them shots without pinning them down and holding them down on the ground. And functionally, it works very well that way. Doctoring sheep couldn't have been easier but I wouldn't suggest using any goats or sheep that have horns their horns would get stuck in the elastic webbing when you lie them down into the chair but that's okay because hornless sheep is all we have I also love how this makes the sheep look it really looks like they're sitting down for a cup of tea and a pedicure but they definitely gave me a fight before I got them down into the chair that sheep really wanted to dance. But luckily I have better moves and I whipped that sheep into submission. Lastly, practicality. Is this sheep chair really worth having? It definitely makes trimming hooves and doctoring the sheep much easier. But for $150, I don't know. Better get your bored grandpa to buy it when you really need it. I mean, I like it, but it's just hard to get that sheep into the chair is what I'm saying. That's the hard part. But once they're in the chair, they are not coming back out. They get so comfortable in that chair that you really have to lift them out of it. After we dock through the sheep, like trimming their hooves and giving them a foot rot shot, we let them back into the field so they can heal up. So what do you give the sheep chair? Four and a half. I wish it was, huh? At least a nine out of ten. Oh, I'm, yeah, four and a half out of ten. I mean, four and a half out of five. Five. Stop. Let's just try again. I was so tired, I could barely keep my marbles straight. I was really not expecting to flip over hundreds of sheep that day. Anyway, let's try that again. I will give it a nine out of ten. Rating for the sheep chair. The only problem with it is it's really, really hard to get a sheep into it. But other than that, it's really nice to have. Go to Amazon and check out the link below if you actually wanna buy this chair. For the sheep or for yourself, it's comfortable enough. My dad also gave his thoughts on it. Definitely improvement. Wish it caught the sheep though. Yeah. Don't we all? Please check out some of my other videos and thank you guys for watching. That's a farm. Hey.